गुड मॉर्निंग मैम Good morning, everyone. Turn your cameras on, please. Yogya is the only person who understands English. Yogya and Ridhima. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, dear. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, dear. Let's wait for two more minutes and then we'll begin, okay? Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, Data. Let's give one more minute for the children to join in, then we can get started, okay? Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, dear. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, Vita. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, dear. So good morning, everyone. How are you all? Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Great. Good morning, ma'am. Everyone, everyone. How are you all? 
I'm great. What about you? I'm good too. Thank you for asking. Um, before I go ahead and start the workshop, uh, your exams are starting from tomorrow, right? Um, yes. Yes. Yeah. So do your exams really well, and don't go ahead and cheat yourself in the exams. Just because no one is watching you does not mean that you ask when you don't know the answers. Because if you don't know the answers and you don't try, that is still okay because you know where you stand, right? But if you ask the answers and write and you get very good marks, it be a satisfaction name later, why? Because you know that marks that you've got was not with true honesty, right? So focus on your exams and do your exams really well. All the best, everyone. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. And tell me, what was the last topic that we had done? Ma'am, public speaking. Public, yes, speaking. public speaking. Great. So did I give you any homework for public speaking or to prepare on a topic? When you said that, I will ask your hobby and you should speak for one minute. About what? Ma'am, our hobby. Some hobby. About your hobbies. Okay. All right. Great. So Nana will tell me her hobby and she will speak for a minute. Then. Yeah, Nana. Nana? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, my ma hobby is to dancing. I like it. Okay, and that is a minute. It is not even 10 seconds later. Talk more. Ma'am, can I try? No, Keria, go ahead. Ma'am, yes. My hobby is... Nana did not do her homework. Yeah. Ma'am, yes, my hobby is dancing. I love to dance. There are now India developed in dance. There are many types of dances like hip hop, electro, dandy hip hop, popping, belly, ballet, uh, popping, belly, ballet, etc. are types of dances. I dance when I got, I dance when I completed all my homework and done all my schoolwork and submitted my homework. I dance at that time. Uh, I, I love to taught any step to anyone. Uh, I love to not any step to anyone. Uh, I love dancing, so that's why I opened my YouTube channel because of that, ma'am. Yes, I uh, I want to become a great dancer in my life, mm -hmm. and uh, I want to become a great dancer in my life. That's why I love dancing. And what form of dance do you do? You didn't say that, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I like hip hop. Hip hop and. You have a YouTube channel. What's the name of your channel? Let me just search you. Ma'am, Ajia Malhotra. Just give me a second, okay? Ajia Malhotra, yeah. Yeah, tell me. Bas itna hi hai? Ma'am, yes. Ajia Malhotra. Okay, if I check you, I can find you, right? Ma'am, I opened it recently, so yet it not grows as well. Okay, no problem. So Ria is R capital and M capital. You have your name as capital letters, your name and your surname, right? Ma'am, no, ma'am, R capital and only M capital, rest small. Right. Okay, let me search you. All right, good job. Anyone else who want to talk about their hobbies for a minute? Ma'am, have I speak for a minute? Uh, no, I want another person to speak. Ma'am, no, ma'am, I'm asking I speak for a minute or not? A little less than that, okay? But that's still okay because I knew you worked. Thank you. Vanshika, yeah, Vanshika. Ma'am, my name is Vanshika Sharma. I'm reading class 8th. Uh, my hobby is cycling and dancing. I should, I like uh, hip-hop and western dance. And ma'am, 
my hobbies also mom i have make a video on youtube okay and uh, uh, my hobby my hobby is cycling and dancing i like uh, uh, hip hop and zumba and western dance and mom i i like i make a video on youtube thank you ma'am You see, I said that. See, you did not even speak for thirty seconds, dear, and because you did not have any words to speak, you were speaking the same thing again. You have not said what you said. You have said two times. So we need to practice. Without practicing, how can we expect that we will do good? Yeah, Ayan, can you tell? Can you tell me about your hobby, Vita? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, I am. Yeah. Okay, ma'am. Greetings, respected teachers and my dear friends. I am is present here to tell you all about the different kind of activities done in my leisure time. So let's start. First of all, I love to play badminton with my friends in the park, which is in front of our house. Uh, besides of that i love to draw and sketch i have a collection of drawings with me in a folder as it is my uh, uh, as it, this hobby comes first in my the, in the list of my hobbies next is i also love to i also love to do cycling in my in my society as there are no restrictions for us to as a, as there are as it is a private society so no one no one disallows us to cycle in the society but yes sometimes if we do that cycling in the park someone don't allow us thank you ah <laughs> uh, no problem all right well and some day i'll see your collections of drawings okay Yes, ma'am. I have a collection of drawings. Amazing. What kind of drawing do you do, ma'am? Sketches. Sketches. Sketches of what? Nature, human beings, what? Ma'am, different kinds of sketches. I cannot tell you, but I can show you if you can give a minute. Okay, show me certain sketches. Yeah, I'd love to see them. Ma'am, can you give me a minute to? All right. Take out no problem. Go and get it. In the meanwhile, okay. I'll ask someone else. Yeah, the last person I would want him or her to speak. Who? Vanshika. Yeah, Vanshika, go ahead. Vanshika. Yeah, Nishta. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, please speak. Ma'am, oh, I you have. You have spoken, right? Blow it on your hand, Vita. Nishta. Um, yes. Good morning to all. My name is Nishta Gurg of Class Eight B. Today I am going to present my hobby. My hobby is drawing and reading books. So in the lockdown, I have made some of the drawings, uh, which are uh, the type of like Happy Mom. Uh, uh, that day when there was Ganesh Chaturthi, I have drawn Ganesh Ji, mm -hmm. and I have drawn a, a house where it is has balloons. Can I show? No, not you have it right now. Mom, yes. Okay. Mom, what is? Okay, they are lost, both of them. Ayan, have you come? Mom, 
by my phone. Okay, Nishta, you need to turn your camera. You said it is with you, which you had gone to get it. Okay. All right, very well. Right, great. Right, that's also very beautiful. The second one I loved more. Yeah, very great. All right. Okay, Beta, you're supposed to talk. Okay, yeah. Continue speaking. Um, it is a pencil drawing, which is of a forest. Mm -hmm. uh, I have done it by pencil shading. We have uh, in the seventh class when we were in that. So there was a summer camp of drawing class. So mm -hmm. uh, Ajil Mam has teach us these two drawings. All right, great. Okay, so uh, Ayan, I have you come. So he's lost. So children, what I would want you to do is um, we will continue with this next time. So let's begin with today's topic of the workshop. Okay. Well, yes, I have so, found those. All right, give me a minute. Turn your camera on then. Then only can I spotlight you. Wow, beautiful. All right, beautiful. That one also, though scary for me. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Very good. Mm, very nice. Right, very nice. The sketch is nice. Very nice. Yeah, wow, cute one. Then one eye is also made. All right, very great. Okay, good job. So, yeah, keep it up and continue doing this because by the time you go, you will become, you know, great at it. Even my, uh, my husband is a great artist, not a great artist, but he loves to draw. I'll show you his drawing next time in the next class. All right, Aya? Okay, ma'am. Okay, all right. So today what I'll be doing is I'll be telling you a story and this story will help us connect to the topic of the workshop. So this story that I'm telling you is about a boy, okay? About a boy who was very, very lazy and did not want to do anything at all in his life. So uh, one day the father was working or uh, walking on the park and he was very, very worried because his son was a very lazy, person. So while he was walking, he met a wise man. And that wise man asked, why do you look so bothered? And he said, I look bothered because my son is very, very lazy. He does not do anything on time. And he uh, does not even have the habit of going ahead and following a certain routine in his life. So the wise man says, don't worry, okay? Do one thing. I would want you to go ahead and get your son in the park tomorrow. And the father goes and brings the son with him tomorrow morning in the park. And both are wa walking on the park together. And while they are walking on the park together, the wise man just accompanies them. And while they, he tells, uh, what's your name, son? And he says, my name is Tejas, okay? So uh, Tejas, while we are walking, can we talk? He says, yes, sure. So uh, Tejas, Guruji Bolte, the wise man. Uh, Tejas, I want you to go ahead and uh, get me um, this small uh, root or the small stem of this plant. So he goes, he breaks the stem and he gives it to the person, okay? Then they walk a little 
ahead and they meet a shrub, okay? A, a herb, first of all, they were asked to take out the herb. So it easily removes the herbs and gives it to the Guruji, all right? The second they meet, they walk and they find a small shrub, a small rose bush. And he says, Beta, can you go ahead and give me a small stem of this uh, shrub? He goes, he puts a little effort, shakes it, and he takes that out and he gives it to the guru. Now he goes to the, and as they are walking, he meets a climber. He says, Beta, can you go ahead and, you know, shake this climber for me? He goes, he shakes the climbers and he gets a little of the fruits that were there on the climbers and he gives it to the guru. Now, as they walk upon, they meet a huge tree. He says, dear son, what I would want you to do is I want you to go ahead and shake that tree for me. He looks at that guru and he says, what's wrong with you, Guruji? How can I go ahead and even shake this tree a bit? And Guru says, why? Why can't you shake it? Because he says, it has its roots, which is so much grounded to, to the soil. So, and because of it, it has become so strong that kuch bhi ho, no one will be able to shake it. And at that point of time, the Guruji says, yes, Peter, that is correct. You cannot shake the tree because it is rooted, it, ki jare is rooted to the ground so firmly that kuch bhi ho, no one can shake it. And at that point of time, uh, Guruji says, the same is with our habits. If we go ahead and form our habits correct, then no matter what happens, no matter what situation we are in, we will not be able to change our habits. Our habits will always remain the way we keep it. So if your habits are great and you follow them every day then it becomes a part of your routine and it becomes so easy for you to follow but if you are lazy and you don't have a routine in your life then it becomes very very difficult to make a routine and follow that routine okay so from this story, what I am trying to say is making a routine in our lives plays a very, very important role. And to therefore, today's topic of the workshop is getting great results by making checklists. What is the topic of today's workshop, everyone? Getting great results. Getting by great results by making checklists. Right, creating, getting great results by making checklists. So can anyone tell me what is a checklist? And what? It is a list that we made to do tomorrow or uh, today. Okay, and what is a list in which we have, in which we have two columns in one list, we have write uh, the things that attracted us while studying and in one list we have write uh, we have write the work we have to complete today. All right, thank you very much. So what else is a checklist? What else is a to-do list? It itself says a to-do list or a checklist. A checklist is also known as a to-do list. The things we have to do today or tomorrow. Tomorrow. All right. So basically, a checklist is a list of things that you need to do tomorrow. Okay. So this checklist is very, very important for all of us to make. And the only reason why it is important to make this checklist is how many people find time management plays a very important role in our lives. Please raise your hands. 
who feels time management plays a very important role. Great. And how many people think man important to hai manage but manage nahi hota. How many people feel that? Raise your hands. Great. And one of the best ways that helps us to manage that time effectively is by making a checklist. So all these great people um, from uh, successful to rich to people who are, you know, very famous, all of them make a checklist in their life. And even for that example, our mothers, our mother also makes a checklist. For example, Wona market jati hai sauda karne ke liye. So she makes all the list of things that she needs to buy. Yes or no? Yes, ma'am. And when she has bought that thing, kya karti hai? Wo kaatti hai. Kaatti jati hai, kaatti jati hai, kaatti jati hai. Aur usme se maan lo, the list of things that she has bought, sara khatam ho gaya. Aur unke paas wo paise pat jati hai. Right? So she can use the money in buying anything that she wants to buy, right? So very, very important that we also do need to make a checklist in our everyday life. Tomorrow our exams begins. So the first important thing today night, what we need to do is make a checklist for tomorrow. Ki kal ki din mein tum kya kya karoge? And the most important thing about making a checklist is to give a time to that thing that you have written. For example, many maths practice karungi likai. You need to write a time line for it so that you don't exceed that time. Because agar tumne wo time exceed kar liya, then the, you will not be able to complete your checklist. So try to do that thing within that timeline. Or agar nahi ho pata, then do it at a later point of time. But what we need to do is make that checklist and follow the timings given. And while making a checklist, it is very important that we need to prioritize our work. So ye nahi hota ho, ki sabse unimportant kaam upar rakh diya aur sabse important kaam niche rakh diya. So what will happen then? What will happen if I don't prioritize my checklist? Our important work will be left behind. Thank you very much. Our important work will be left behind. Very good, Gauri. And uh, for example, let's take uh, and we children are funny, you know. Hamara jo subject hai, jo hume bohot difficult lagta hai. Okay? It is always at the bottom. It is never at the top. For example, if our, let's take my example. If SST is a subject that I find very difficult and the teacher has given me a lot of homework, I will begin with the homework that I love the most. जो दिल को सबसे अच्छा लगता है ना वो ही होमवर्क हम फर्स्ट करते हैं ये सब नो यस मैम फिर सेकंड बेस्ट फिर थर्ड बेस्ट फिर फोर्थ बेस्ट करते जाएंगे और जब तक हमारे डिफिकल्ट जो पसंद नहीं आया वहां तक पहुंचेंगे हम क्या बोलेंगे अरे यार बहुत थक गए बाद में करते हैं अरे यार ये सब तो पसंद भी नहीं है दोस्त से कॉपी कर लूंगा and then we only say, Mere SST mein achche marks nahi aate hai. Jitna bhi koshish karo. Right? Kaise aayega beta? List mein itne bottom pe jo rakha hai. So very, very important. When you are do, making your checklist, you need to keep the most important work first and the most difficult work first. Kyunki jab a most difficult work फर्स्ट पे रखेंगे तो क्या होगा कर लिया डिफिकल्ट वर्क बिकॉज वेन एवर वी गेट अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग वी आर फ्रेश राइट एंड इफ वी डू द मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट वर्क फर्स्ट देन 
आ सबसे डिफिकल्ट काम खत्म हो गया अब तो आराम से करेंगे बोल के हम कर लेंगे राइट अगर अगर वो ये बॉटम पे रखा है तो जब तक हम वहां पहुंचते हैं हमें करने का मन ही नहीं करता सो वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू प्रायोरिटाइज टू डू लिस्ट एंड वाइल मेकिंग अ टू डू लिस्ट वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वंस ऑल द लिस्ट इज कंप्लीटेड यू कैन रिवॉर्ड योर सेल्फ with any of the distractions because while we get down to study there are a lot of distractions that comes our way yes or no ma'am yes can you tell me some of the distractions ma'am food food for example you can keep a break for your food in your to do list only because food is important but kya hota hai for example we are studying right all of a sudden you say amazing maggi ki khushboo aa gayi dorte hue gayi kitchen mein mummy khana bana rahe ho kya mummy ne bola ha beta mujhe bhi khana hai ha ja pad le jab ban jayega i'll call you so she goes in she studies अरे मेरा मैं आगे बन रहा है अरे इतना टाइम क्यों लग रहा है मम्मी को मैगी देने में अरे यार इतना टाइम लग गया चेक करू जरा राइट एंड वी गेट डिस्ट्रैक्टेड फूड फूड इज आर डिस्ट्रैक्शन व्हाट एल्स मैम टीवी टेलीविजन इज आर डिस्ट्रैक्शन द मोमेंट वी आर वाचिंग टेलीविजन और Uh, mobiles or anything on laptop how are we like this and the more interest jitna badega our mouth will be like this jitna interest badta hai movie utna bad jayega right but when it comes to our studies what happens is our attention is so low right so these are distractions our tvs are our distraction and sometimes the funny thing also happens with us children that we studied 2 ghante pad liya pad liya pad liya pad liya ab 2 ghante ho gaye padhai ke dekho zara mobile bol ke aise khali chhote ho mummy darwaza kholegi aur bol patta tha mujhe tu pad nahi rahi hogi mujhe patta tha tu mobile hi khel rahi hogi and then you try to explain mummy abhi chhua khali tha will your mother believe you ma'am no no, no. because din bhar mobile ke sath hi chipke hote ho yes or no ma'am ma yes. Yes. yes right and the third distraction is your friends jaise hi padhne baith gaye what happens balcony se awaaz aayi um for example saksha सक्षम गया बैंक में क्या हुआ आजा पढ़ने के आजा खेलने के लिए एंड देन ही सेस पढ़ा आजा ना देन ही सेन से मम्मी जाऊं थोड़ी देर के लिए सक्षम बुला रहे अब भी तो पढ़ने बैठा है नहीं मम्मी प्रॉमिस आ जाऊंगा द मोमेंट सक्षम गोस एक टाइम भूल जाता है दैट ही हैज अ चेकलिस्ट टू फॉलो एंड ही गोस ऑन प्लेइंग ही गोस ऑन प्ले right and then mummy comes out and says shaksham come and he says aa raha hu mummy phir 10 15 minute ho gaye phir gayi shaksham ab to aa jao mamma 10 minute andar mummy is like shaksham itna badtameez ho gaya hai na sunta hi nahi hai meri baat to and then papa comes kya hua shaksham ko kab se bula rahi ho bula raha hu bula rahi hu sunta hi nahi ऐसी बात है क्या रुको सक्षम पापा आ गया दौड़ते हुए पहुंच जाता है पापा के आवाज पे क्यों क्योंकि पापा से पढ़ेगी डांट बजेगी राइट सो वाइल प्रिपेयरिंग अ टू डू लिस्ट वी नीड टू कीप सर्टेन गैप्स आल्सो बिकॉज इफ यू कंटिन्यूअसली कीप स्टार्टिंग 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 यू नो your brain will not be able to go ahead and take everything that you are studying okay but just ensure when you are giving breaks in between your breaks 
should not exceed the timeline. But most of the times, क्या होता है? हम हमारा जो gaps देते हैं breaks का, it always exceeds because of which we are not able to complete our to do list. Right, so there are a lot of distractions. Our siblings, our siblings are our biggest distraction. जब कुछ नहीं कर रहे होते हैं ना, कभी disturb करने नहीं आएंगे। But जब भी कुछ important होता है, they have that sixth sense, and they come and say, दीदी खेलने चलो ना, भैया खेलने चलो ना, and then do you say, नहीं नहीं पढ़ना है paper है, अरे थोड़ी देर चलो ना, and then if you say no. They will take your book and run away and say, "Mujhe pakda," right? And then, guilty say, "Tumne pakda liya, dant diya." So, what will happen? And then, mother comes and says, "Kya hua, beta? Didi ne mara." And then, I have to justify, "Maine mara nahi tha, nahi nahi mara," right? So. All these are distractions. Your TVs, your mobile phone, listening to music, right? These are also important because you can't continuously have your to-do list with all work, 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 right? It needs to be blended with your gaps of free time as well to to keep you again refreshed. So very very important that you need to prepare the to do list. And once you've prepared the to do list and everything is over, start cutting what is done so that you may patao ki aaj ke din ka sabi kuch khatam ho gaya. And then once you have finished everything, sara free time kis ka hai? It is yours. So you can do anything you want in your free time once all your to-do list is completed. Some children love to draw; they can draw. Some children love listening to music; they can listen to music. Some children love chit-chatting with their friends on phones. You can do that. But if work is not complete and the phone is stuck, then what will you say, Mummy? Then we talk on the phone with friends, right? But if your pay, if your work is already done, Then no one will question you about anything. So now tell me, what are some of the benefits if we follow a to-do list, or if we prepare a check uh, to checklist and follow them? What are some of the benefits? Um, our planning work will be completed if oh, yeah. we. Plan. Our time will be utilized, and our work will be done in short time. Thank you very much. and because of that you'll be able to save time the first benefit is you'll be able to save time and you can do anything that you wish to do. and we can do other activities that we like in free time very good and ma'am we will complete our work uh, in the complete time. right you complete everything because of which you will re receive praise and appreciation what else You will become more efficient. If you follow the routine, follow, do, 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 you create a good impression about yourself yes or no ma'am ma'am yes right so what i want you to do today is tomorrow kal ka din try to make a to do list and follow that to do list okay and ye exam tak aap to do list bana ke follow karo trust me your exams will definitely go well but ensure while keeping a to do list just ensure one thing prioritize your work whatever is the most important have it at the top and what is least important have it at the bottom and mix it with your uh, some uh, break times in between so that you can do something that you love 
सो दैट इट रिफ्रेशेज योर माइंड कितने बच्चे क्या होता है स्ट्रेट कंटिन्यूसली सुबह तक रात सुबह से रात तक पढ़ते हैं सो वॉट इज द प्रॉब्लम After they finishes, they are blank. Ma'am, because all concepts mix in our mind. Right. Not only that, you become blank because you have not given a break to your mind. Because it, we have here, हमारे दिमाग के यहाँ ना, there is a subconscious mind, and that subconscious mind will never be able to understand कि तुम क्या कर रहे हो. so very very important give yourselves break but does not mean padhai ek ghanta karo break bhi ek ghante ka do padhai ek ghante ka karo but give a break of 20 to 20 to 25 minutes got it so with this note we have come to the end of today's workshop children uh, i want you to really do well on your exams all the best and we will do some activities in the next class all right everyone okay ma'am have a good day full day ma'am activities in the next class because Thanks, i think all our topics are over okay okay ma'am have a wonderful day ma'am have a nice day ma'am well ma'am take care bye bye everyone in the class ma have a great day all of you take care bye bye have a great day ma'am